Greetings, my dear brothers and sisters. It is an amazing day that I present to you this amazing word for you. Remember that God still cares about you. He still loves you. He has not forsaken you. God thinks about you. God loves you so, so much. More than your enemies. More than your neighbors. More than your friends. More than your family. God loves you so, so much. So, don't think that God has forgotten you. He still thinks about you. And he's going to rescue you. Now, my brothers and sisters, the word that I have for you right now is they are planning something, something evil. So, get out before it is too late. This is a word of direction, in other words. That people are planning something against you. Something evil. There are people around you that you should never have actually gotten involved in. There are people who you speak to that you are never supposed to speak to. Because these are people that will lead you to places of no return. These are people that are diabolic in nature. And they will never change their ways. So it is time to get out before it is too late. Brothers and sisters, this is a word for you. And you will know them when you get in, in, in touch with them. Beware of the group that came to you. Beware of that person that came to you. It may seem that they like you, but they don't like you. Don't go to, with them to places that they have requested you to go to. It is better for you to stay alone at home. And read your word. It is better for you than to just accept people in your life. Some people come with a bad agenda. They come to kill. Some of them, actually, the people you got in touch with, you may not know that they are being used by the enemy. They themselves may have good intentions for you, but their lifestyle, their lifestyle doesn't line up with the word of God. Some of them have introduced you to clubs. Some of them have introduced you to pubs. Some of them are introducing you to smoking, to drinking. Be very careful. Don't allow those behaviors into your uh, lifestyle because they are going to drag you down. You are supposed to be up. You are supposed to be an influencer. Not some people to influence you. No. Brothers and sisters, don't walk with them. Remember, this word is not for everyone. It is for someone. Someone specific who is watching me right now. And you know exactly what I'm talking about. You know the person you're supposed to get rid of. You may love the person. But their lifestyle. Their lifestyle rebels against the, 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 the things of God. Their lifestyle is against the will of God. Their lifestyle is not good. Stay away from them. Scripture says, Can two walk together unless they agree? In other words, for you to walk to with someone, for you to walk with someone a mile, two miles, five miles, you're supposed to come in agreement. Even a relationship comes with an agreement. You don't just enter a relationship just like that. You have to agree. Whether that person is right for you or not right for you. Even a business deal, even work, those that are working right now, you had to agree to the terms and conditions. Even where you stay, some of you are renting out. You agree with the terms and conditions. That's why you have a tenant's agreement. Where you sign it to agree that... I, at this month or the end of the month or at the beginning of this month, you pay this amount of money. Some tenants agreement, they have uh, uh, things that uh, stipulate that uh, if you break something in the house, you have to replace it or you have to pay it. So my brothers and sisters, that is how God wants you to do these things. He wants you to know these 
things that are happening in your life that if there is someone planning evil against you you are supposed to walk away from it don't go towards the direction of evil but run away from evil run away from evil people run away from haters oh yes run away from gossipers even gossipers are dangerous to your to, to you they are dangerous to your destiny because you know my, my brothers and sisters uh if you mix uh, a good tomato or a good apple with bad apples that apple that was good with some time it will get bad it will be affected what am i trying to say that no matter how good you are if you mix up with the wrong people they will teach you wrong things soon or later you are going to become like them you are going to start speaking like them unconsciously you start speaking like them you start acting like them the things that you tolerated will be the things that you loved there is this is true so it is important that when you see something you run away from it when you see danger don't wait until it it hits your hand or it injures you run my brothers and sisters this is the word that i have for you i hope it has been a blessing to you i hope it has encouraged you and my brothers and sisters remember that i release powerful words every single day and you can also connect through my facebook page which is in the about section and you will be able to receive words that will help you out in your journey with god not with men but with god brothers and sisters until next time shalom